Theresa May will aim to strike a defiant tone in her upcoming Brexit speech on the risks to the rest of the EU of giving Britain a raw deal, echoing the combative approach taken by the Chancellor. In a speech by the Prime Minister on Tuesday that will be watched closely in the EU capitals, Downing Street is keen to impress that there are potentially lucrative economic opportunities elsewhere, weeks before the UK is expected to trigger Article 50. Philip Hammond, in an interview with German newspaper Weltanz on Tag, warned that Britain would do whatever we have to do to regain competitiveness and appeared to accept that the UK was prepared to become a tax haven if necessary. The stories you need to read, in one handy email. Read more The Chancellor was responding to a suggestion that the impression on the European continent is that your government sees the future business model of the UK as being the tax haven of Europe. Hammond said most of us who had voted Remain would like the UK to remain a recognizably European-style economy, with European-style taxation systems, European-style regulation systems etc. I personally hope we will be able to remain in the mainstream of European economic and social thinking. But if we are forced to be something different, then we will have to become something different. The Labour leader, Jeremy Corbyn, said the comments suggested the threat of some sort of trade war with Britain's EU partners and accused Hammond of wanting to turn the UK into a bargain basement economy. It really doesn't seem to me to be a very sensible way forward, he said. Brexiters in the cabinet believe the government would be better placed to reach ambitious trade deals with countries outside the EU, including the US, if it were not tied into existing arrangements. The pound hit a fresh 31-year low in the wake of reports on May's speech, falling below $1.20 in trading on Sunday night. One analyst warned that sterling will go on the market roller coaster following the claims that the UK will seek a hard Brexit. So far, the EU leaders have been united in saying there will be no cherry-picking of legislation, suggesting that May will not be able to impose strict limits on immigration while retaining the economic benefits of EU membership.